Ways to invest during rising interest rates. Warren Buffett's financial advice. Hey guys, today we're going to look on ways to invest during rising interest rates. Warren Buffett's financial advice. Let's get right into it. With prices sharply on the rise, it's worth revisiting some of Buffett's best suggestions for combating what he once referred to as gigantic corporate tapeworm. Let's list them out. Number 1. Invest in good businesses with low capital needs Buffett has long advocated for owning businesses that generate high returns on capital invested. During inflationary times, businesses with low capital requirements that can maintain their earnings should fare better than those that must invest more money at ever higher prices just to stay in business. Buffett once compared the inflationary challenge to running up a down escalator. Number 2. Look for companies that can raise prices during periods of higher inflation Buffett told the Financial Crisis Inquiry Commission in 2010, the single most important decision in evaluating a business is pricing power. He then added, you've got the power to raise prices without losing business to a competitor and you've got a very good business. If a company can raise its prices, it has a significant advantage during periods of high inflation because it can offset its own rising costs. Buffett once stated, that in an inflationary world, an unregulated toll bridge would be the ideal asset to own because you would have already built the bridge and could raise prices to offset inflation. He said, you build the bridge in old dollars and you don't have to keep replacing it. Number 3. Take a look at tips. Tips or treasury inflation protected securities are another Buffett recommended investment for investors concerned about rising inflation. Tips pay a fixed interest rate twice a year to investors, but the principal amount is adjusted for inflation using the consumer price index. Number 4. Invest in yourself and be the best at what you do. Buffett told shareholders in 2004 that investing in one's own talent is one of the best ways to maintain purchasing power over time. The best surgeon or lawyer in a city or town benefits from an education paid for in old dollars, but can charge current dollars for their services without having to re-educate themselves. Consider adding a new skill to your resume by attending a local college or learning a new skill online. Advanced degrees can be costly, but they can also help you expand your knowledge and make you an indispensable employee in the future. Increasing your value to your employer and its customers will enable you to command a fair share of your earnings over time. He also mentioned this in his 2022 Berkshire Hathaway annual shareholders meeting. He said, The best thing you can do is to be exceptionally good at something. Mentioning professions like doctors and lawyers as examples, Buffett said that people are going to give you some of what they produce in exchange for what you deliver. Buffett added that skills, unlike currency, are inflation-proof. If you have a skill that is in demand, it will remain in demand, no matter what the dollar is worth. He said, whatever abilities you have can't be taken away from you. They can't actually be inflated away from you. He then added, the best investment by far is anything that develops yourself and is not taxed at all. Number 5. Steer clear of traditional bonds. Buffett wrote in his 2020 letter to Berkshire shareholders, Bonds are not the place to be these days. Bond investors may suffer significantly if interest rates remain near historically low levels in an inflationary environment. Buffett has stated that buying a 10-year bond yielding 2% is comparable to paying 50 times earnings for a business, with the key difference being that the bond's earnings cannot grow. He said, Fixed income investors worldwide, whether pension funds, insurance companies or retirees, face a bleak future. Number 6. Limit Your Wants Buffett's business partner and vice chairman of Berkshire Hathaway, Charlie Munger, has his own take for how best to cope with periods of high inflation. He told Berkshire shareholders back in 2004, One of the great defenses to being worried about inflation is not having a lot of silly needs in your life. He then added, In other words, if you haven't created a lot of artificial demand to drown in consumer goods, why? You have a considerable defense against the vicissitudes of life. To help with this, consider tracking your expenses through a budgeting app. This will help you understand how you're currently spending your money and may help identify problematic spending bursts before they become a habit. Number 7. What about gold? Notably, Buffett has avoided gold, which is widely regarded as an excellent inflation hedge. Gold investors are particularly concerned about the impact of inflation on paper money, which Buffett shares. But as he noted in 2011, if you own one ounce of gold for an eternity, you will still own one ounce at its end. Instead, he prefers to own productive assets such as stocks, real estate or farmland that generate dividends, income and food for their owners. Recently, some have referred to cryptocurrencies as the digital version of gold, but Buffett is highly skeptical of these as well. He told CNBC in 2019, 
Bitcoin has no unique value at all. He then added, it doesn't produce anything. You can stare at it all day and no little bitcoins come out or anything like that. It's a delusion, basically. It's still unclear whether the current inflationary surge will last or begin to subside. If you're concerned about rising inflation, follow Buffett's advice and invest in productive assets, such as high-quality businesses with low capital requirements, rather than low-yielding bonds that don't increase payments in tandem with inflation rates. That's all for today, and we'll be sure to catch you all in the next one.